property fire sales. I'm sure buyers out there will be keen to know whether COVID-19 situation will lead to property fire sales in the upcoming months. I classified this topic into two broad categories, the new launch market and the resale market. Today, I'll be mainly focusing on the resale market itself. Before I go into this topic, we must understand what lead to property fire sales. I generally classify them into three categories that lead to property fire sales in the resale market. Owners are unable to serve their installment. Second reason could be due to valuation of the property dropped drastically. They lead to banks calling them out for repayment. And they are unable to do the repayment, so they just sell the property cheap. Third, could be business owners out there having properties on hand need to sell off their property cheap and fast for cash flow so that they can serve their business obligations. So understanding that what caused property fire sale in the recent market, we must see what are the measures in place by the government. I will first go touch base on what are the measures has been rolled out before, before COVID-19 situations. We have a few fact, a few measures in place already. One of them is the loan to value. Currently, we have 75 loan to value measures. A 12 to 25% uh, additional buyer stamp duty. And we have 4 to 12% seller stamp duty. Lastly, we have a 60% total debt service ratio. You can see before and after, what are the measures, the difference? Before we have a zero loan to value. We have a zero additional buyer stamp duty. We have zero seller stamp duty. And we do have TDSR in place also. So what are the measures that's been in place by the government before, even before COVID-19 is they make sure that buyer out there are buying property at a very prudent way in terms of using their finance, not overstretching their own finance. Beside that, they also put in place a measure that removes speculator in the markets. What they do, they actually put in place seller stamp duty and additional buyer stamp duty. So generally in the market, buyer out there at the purchase ready, they're actually in a very safe and prudent method when doing the purchase through their finance. So, understand the measure in place already before COVID-19. Let's see what are the measures rolled out during COVID-19. Measure that's been rolled out for COVID-19 situation. As you can see, there's a deferred repayment for residential properties. In such, if owners are unable to make repayment, of their installment, they can seek for deferred repayment. Beside that, the TDSR has been waived for such repayment. As for business owner, the government has increased their loan risk up to 90% so that this firm, the owner themselves, are able to seek for more credits, which is more loan, so there's more cash flow for them. And beside that, if they are unable to serve their contractual obligations, they have such relief for them due to COVID-19 situations. As you can see, there's a lot of measures been in place to protect a lot of uh, uncertainty. So do you think that we will have be able to see a lot of uh, fire sales in the market in the upcoming months? Personally, I don't think so. If not, it will be very marginal. What do you think? Maybe you have a different um, perceptions or different uh, views. You can give me a call or give me a text or PM me through my Facebook. Thank you. I'm James Ho here. See you soon for the next topic for the new launch.